So today we're looking at the June 2013 Biology AQA High paper. And let's start off by looking at question one. So question one says, Dr. Semmelweis compared the death rates of women in two hospital wards, Ward A and Ward B. And then we've got table one, which shows some of the results. The civil text which says, before 1840, doctors and nurses worked in Ward A and in Ward B. The doctors often worked in other wards with patients who had diseases, and the doctors did not wash their hands. After 1840, doctors only worked in Ward A and not in Ward B. Only nurses worked in Ward B. The nurses did not work in the other wards with patients who had diseases. So question 1A says, look at the data for Ward A and Ward B after 1840. Describe the effect on the death rate of having two nurses working in Ward B and not doctors. To gain full marks, you must refer to the data in Table 1. So what this question is basically asking you is to look at the data and be able to describe it. And this is a two mark question. So let's have a look at the data. So we've got Ward A and Ward B. We know that in pre-1840, doctors worked in both Ward A and Ward B, and they often didn't wash their hands. And we can see here that the death rates are quite similar, 7.7, 7 7.4, 7 7.5, and 7.8. And then we can see in post-1840, when the doctors only worked in Ward A, the death rate is a little bit higher, 8.4 and 11.3, but the death rate in Ward B has dramatically fallen to 2.1, 2.8. So this is what we, the question is asking us to describe. So what we need to put down in the answer is that the death rates has fallen. It would be. And also, it's asking us to get full marks, we need to refer to the data. So we actually need to quote the data. So we can say pre 1840, the death rate was 7.8. In Ward B in 1918, in 1836. And then you can say post 1840 and 1844, the death rate is now 2.1, showing a significant decrease.